We'll take care of you. All right, we gotta meet Steve in front of the crazy Guys! The good news is he's gonna help us out. Bad news is he's I, I can't even get back. in my car, bro. Would you kill him? Jeez, jo Joe. Seriously? Well, welcome, it's Johnny, and welcome back to Mafia 2 Definitive Edition. We'll be continuing our story. I think we're on chapter 8, where we left off. Um, it's been a few days since I've played it. Also, got a kink in my neck, so if you see me doing this weird stuff, I apologize. Yep, chapter 8, the wild ones. <laughs> Uptown, April 11th, 1951. Uh, what the fuck? Hey, Vito, rise and shine. Jesus. <laughs> Marty, stop fucking yelling, will you? My head's killing me. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, Joey. Stop calling me fucking Joey. What the hell's wrong with you? Vito, come on down. Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and open this door. Go ahead and grab our clothes. Oh, we got different colors, black and white. Let's go white today. I think, I think, well, actually, have you always been wearing white? I'm not like, sure. let's go black. I don't know what we were wearing. I think black kind of fits the leather anyway. So, even though it's leather, it, it literally can uh, go with any color, to be honest. All right, let's go ahead and go down. Let's go ahead and meet Joe. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Why is all zoomed in? Who the hell was that? Guy's got a voice like Woody fucking Woodpecker. That was Marty. Remember the little kid you slipped down the street from me? I had to pick up the truck here, so he gave me a lift. What's going on with the truck? It's gonna make us some nice cash. Hop in. I'll explain on the way. You drive. Where to? Riverside. All right, Riverside it is. All right. Some night, huh? What's in yeah, there? You could say that. Why? You ain't still mad, are you? Nah. I didn't see a bunch stiff. of boxes. That's the first thing I wanted to do when I got out. Hey, come on. Yeah, All right, let's see if we can. Right? Yeah, right, I guess I we'll did. go this way. Thank you for that. But, uh, oh, this thing's turning. Sucks. Not so much. All right, all right. Well, listen, today's going to be a lot better, right? Oh, this is going to be awful sure driving this. So. Hey. How far away is this place? All right, I'm probably just gonna cut until we get there. Be so much easier. So what's the deal? Simple. We just gotta go to a couple of places and unload these smokes. Then we bring the truck back to Eddie and get our cut of the tape. Piece of cake. Wait a minute. You seem to remember getting thrown in the clink for a piece of cake just like this. Don't worry, I've done this before. First stop, Riverside. If you say so. Trust me, you're gonna thank me later. Yeah, okay. I, I, dude, I, every time we do stuff with Joe, he always gets us in trouble, and we always go to prison, or jail, or the army. He always stays free and does what he has to do. All right, I think we're here. <laughs> what now? Now dude, we take so care of our customers. These guys here buying bulk from us. Come with me. Okay, climb up and hand me the goods. What is all that stuff? Like, it's like boxes of stuff. Hi, one carton of reds. Hand me a carton of reds, Vito. A carton? Oh, cigarettes. Bingo. Gotcha. Here. Hey, good to see you. I'm all out of smoke. Two dollars. Give me a carton of blues. Blues, huh? One cotton of blues, Vito. Bingo. Yeah. Hours later. What the fuck? Hey, Sarge, how you doing? Caught in the blues as usual? You gonna say something or? I think I'll take the whites this time. Okay. Yeah, that Vito. Let's go. Caught in the whites. Got it. Bingo.
Thanks, Joe. Now get the hell out of here, will you? Okay, time to go. Get in, Vito. Next stop is Millville. It's going great today. We're making some serious dough here. Yeah, you are. All right, we have to go all the way down here to Millville. So I'll probably just cut when we get there because it's going to be a long drive. So the kid Mark, he works for Eddie too? <laughs> In his dreams. Kid's not even 18 yet. He does jobs for me. Drives me around, makes deliveries, that sort of stuff. Thinks he's a gangster though. Spends too much damn time at the movies. Well, if the kid's got you for a role model, he's in for a lot of trouble. Oh, yeah, wise Facts. guy. He reminds me a lot of you when you was his age. Exactly. And I spent two years dodging bullets in Europe and six years in the can since I met you. That's what I mean by trouble. What's the matter? Somebody shit in your coffee this morning? It's like you forgot about all the good times. Yeah, remind me of those someday, would you? Did you not see? What did I tell you? It's going like butter today. All right, this almost makes up for last night. Almost. Come on, what's better than this? You got fresh air, good company, and you're making a shitload of dough. Not too bad for a guy who just got out of the slam. All right, all right. Listen, if the next few hours are anything like the last few hours, all's forgiven. There's the veto I know. All right, we'll be there in a second. So, like, last time, last episode, we, uh, we had that dead guy in our, um, trunk. Now we gotta take it out and, uh, bury him. Who's this freaking weirdo? Hey, a cotton of blues, if you please. Absolutely, sir. Give me a cotton of blues. Yeah, that's the one. Okay. There it is, sir. You're welcome. Two dollars. Hi, I'll take a box of reds. Cotton of reds, Vito. I guess maybe that's a lot of money for a card yeah, back that's then. The one. I don't really know. Like, like today, I think it's like fifty bucks or something like that. There it is, I don't, sir. I don't, I don't smoke, so again. I don't really know the the prices, but oh boy. What you selling, Mac? You buying or just window shopping? Maybe. We're selling smokes. Two bucks a carton, hundred bucks a crate. I'll make you a deal. You fuck over ten cartons and maybe we'll let you and your buddy get out of here in one piece. Hey, look, pal. How about you get back in your cute little car with your little friends there and I'll pretend I never seen you. Sound good? <laughs> you don't get it, do you, you fat motherfucker? This is our turf. And it's gonna cost you to operate here. Now pay up. You're the one who doesn't get it. You have any idea who you're talking to? One last chance. You walk away now and... Yeah, I'll tell you who I'm talking to. A fat two-bit fucking Dago door-to-door -door salesman hawking stolen cigarettes on my turf. And it's time to close up shop, asshole. Okay, boys. I think it's time for a fire sale. Oh, they're gonna burn our cigarettes. Shit, go. Oh, fuck. <laughs> what do you say now, Porky? What do I gotta say? That's what I got. Come on, Killed him, bro. That car and let's go. Off the freaking. Right, let's get one of these fucks and teach him a lesson. Off the freak, ED. Burn our cigarettes when you shut him in his face. Joey does not Vito. care. He's away. Bro, I'm going. going. Joe, this thing won't go any faster. Literally as fast as I can. The main guy's car is so freaking slow. Oops. Let's see if we can keep up with him. Come on. There we go. Now we're getting to speed. We just can't hit nothing, but I'm sure Watch said that, so therefore I'm probably gonna hit some. Dude, this that car up there is so fast. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on, Betsy. We're going 100 miles per hour. This thing's just going. Oh, shit. No. Shit. We should check in with Eddie. Stop at the nearest phone booth to call. I don't know what a freaking phone booth is, bro. Phone booth, phone booth, phone booth. Alright, for the phone booth, never about to call Eddie. I, it took me way too long to freaking find this thing. Deal. Listen, we got a problem. We were moving the smokes and then Guys, these, uh, these we get it. came out of nowhere and set the fucking truck on fire. 
Thanks, boss. What the fuck happened? Look, look, Eddie, Eddie. Hey, listen, it's not our fault, okay? They guys. set the fucking truck on fire before we knew what was happening, and everything burned up. What happened to this right, guy? One of the guys, but... What do I fucking care? Just bring me my money. I paid two grand for that truck, and I want it back. Lucky for you two retards, I got Derek's guy Steve here with me. And we were just talking about what to do with those punks. We're gonna take care of them now. Steve will meet you at the Crazy Horse. You know it? Okay. Crazy Horse. Yeah, I know where it is. Steve's gonna have a few guys with him. Show him that nobody fucks with us. No shooting, though. So it looks like just another gang fight. I don't want to read about a bloodbath in the papers tomorrow. All right, sure, Eddie. Don't worry. We'll take care of it. All right, we gotta meet Steve in front of the crazy Guys! Horse. Good news is he's gonna help us out. Bad news is I, I can't even get back. in my car, bro. Too grand Shit. You really think we're gonna get two G's out of these guys? Come on, guys. I don't know. We'll see what Steve's got in mind. You know he ain't doing this out of the kindness of his heart. Let's go. Factual. All right, we're gonna go all the way on the other left-hand side, right? Technically, right side. Uh, but left-hand side where we're going. Pissed on the phone. Sure he was. Just like I'm pissed right now. Even if these assholes ain't got a dime, I'm gonna kick two thousand dollars worth of shit out. I'm with you. But what's Steve doing working for Eddie? He works for Derek, and Derek's with Vinci's crew. How the hell should I know? But hey, you're still gonna take jobs with Derek, right? Even though you're working for Eddie, you all gotta do what we gotta do to get by. Hey, Steve. Hey. Hey, guys. Artie? What are you doing here? Hey, Joe. I'm going with you on this one. Steve needed help. He said I could come along. Steve, uh, isn't this, Man, uh... Kids gotta learn sometime. Okay, why are we here, Steve, huh? The guys we're looking for are all headed to the foundry. This is where they usually meet, so we'll start here, then head over to the foundry to finish the job. And, uh, why'd you volunteer to help us? Those bastards trashed my cousin's car. They robbed him and knocked out three of his teeth. Yeah, those fucking assholes. They make problems all over the city. What did Shut you say up, the kid. Day? <laughs> so, like the Bible says, an eye for an eye, tooth for a tooth. And, well, we'll just start with this joint. So what's the plan? First, we're gonna trash this place. And how are we gonna do that? Burn it down. With this. Oh, we got Tommy gun that biz match. Hey, come on, guys. <laughs> now you can either help us or stay out of our way. <laughs> Let's go teach these fuckers a lesson. <laughs> what the fuck was that? Oh my god. This is really cool though. I'm let, I'm let them take care of it. Handle it. It's cause it's so loud. Okay, that's enough. Let's leave them a little present. Vito, Marty, I got some Molotov cocktails in the trunk. Go get them and throw them in. My pleasure, Steve. Took a Molotov from the trunk of fire and firebomb the bar. Of course, we gotta do all the dirty work. Last one. That'll teach them. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> all right. Now we go to the foundry. Get in, boys. We'll meet you two at the main gate. See you there. Perfect. We're out of the old foundry. I have no door. So that's good. Alright, let's start up the road. I actually, uh... I actually cut all that because, well... I thought it would be a lot longer than that. I see you, Marty. You need to relax, kid. Hey, how'd you get in here? Oof. The fucking yellow brick road. Oof. Next. <laughs> nice one. You fuckers are dead. Joe, watch out. Thanks, kid. Shit, they got guns. Let them have it. I thought we said we can't. I thought we can't freaking shoot them. Back me up, Vito. Bring it on, dick cheese. All right, here we go. Don't be so gentle, boys. Let's go. 
Okay. Okay. Get our health up, health up a little bit here. Okay. Absolutely. You got. You could actually hit him. Right. All right. You guys gotta get the heck out of my way. Oh, come here. Come here. Can't hit this guy to save my life. We go. Try to get a different gun out here. Let's use this, let's use this pistol. Let's go, Vito. Where is he at? There he is. Dude, are you okay? What's this guy doing? Oh my god! What in the actual? Come on. Let's see what else we got. Hold on, let's run over here to this right side here. Okay. Let's do one of these. All right, push up, push up. Perfect, perfect. Can you guys not get in my way, please? Jeez. Gosh. We got more people? My God, there's so many dudes here. All right, let's hit these freaking things right here. Come on, step out. One there. Come on. Man, that didn't even freaking go anywhere. Do I really know what I have? I have no more freaking shotgun ammo. Or can you just not hold it? Come on. My God, dude, these things, these guys are just pushing up and just taking everybody. That's just a kid, it looks like. A grease gun? Give me that. Ooh, that, that guy didn't like that. All right, cover to cover here. Make sure we don't get hit. Boom. Got that guy. Shoot another one on my left hand side up here. Could have swore I just saw another person. Would you kill him? Jeez, jo Joe. Seriously. You die so freaking fast in this game, even on easy. Okay. Perfect. I don't feel like it. Give me all this ammo, dude. I need all the ammo I can get. What's the last guy right here? Boom. God, there's more guys up here to the right? How many dudes are in this compound? Feels like an entire army of greasers. Take him out. Take him out. Take that guy out. All right. You got this good now? Because it feels like he ain't. Pick up the shotgun. All right. Now we got... Oh, his shotgun's in the bottom. That's right. I'm an idiot. My fault. My fault. All right. Let's, uh... Take out this thing. 
Are we good now? Is there more? Oh. God. Who's this guy? Listen, this got way out of hand. Eddie's not gonna be too happy. Eddie will be fine. What are we gonna do? Just let him kill us? These fucking dirtbags won't be bothering nobody. No more. What now, Steve? Now I'm gonna go home and see if that castor oil's working. I've been blocked up for weeks. I'll see you later. Joy, you and I still got a lot of work to do. We'll catch you later. Shit, where are uh. we get the two G's for ready? You got any idea how much a car like this goes for? Damn, Vito, you're a genius. These babies ain't cheap, right? I bet Derek would give us at least a grand for that one. All right, I'm gonna drive this baby over to Derek's. I'll meet you back at the Falcon. Sounds like a plan. Plumbing guess. We're gonna freaking... We're gonna steal it and the cops are gonna be on us. Oh, this car's sweet. Oh man, these cars are sweet, dude. All right, where we gotta go? All the way down here, Jesus. All right, we are here. That's the car walk away from the platform. 1950, bro. Give Eddie his $2,000. Okay, I just take this car. Seriously? Man, he's way over there. I'm taking your guys' car. I don't know whose it is, but I'm taking it. Alright. Now we're gonna go give this to Eddie. The majority of this game is literally just driving places. You can cut out 40 minutes of gameplay just from driving. Alright. Gotta give Eddie so his money. Is the we money. made it. Well, that's a fucking relief. Stupid fucking junkies. Now they know their place. Good work, boys. Here's your cat. Thanks, Eddie. So, you need anything else from us today, or is that it? I got something I gotta take care of. No, 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 that's all for today. I'll call you if I need anything. Sweet. $2,000 gone. My gosh. All right, we are home. I think all we gotta do is go to bed, and that should that should uh, switch over to the chapter nine. Yep. Balls and beans. Uptown, May six, nineteen fifty one. All right, guys, that was chapter eight. I know I didn't really do a lot of commentary. I'm still trying to figure everything out, and I'm I'm freaking tired as a mother. But all right, guys, that was uh, chapter eight. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure you guys do the, the YouTube thing, like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends. Always, guys, my name is Johnny, and I'll be seeing you guys in the next episode. I'm off you to Definitive Edition. See you guys soon.